Hi everyone, I'm Carrie. Thank you for being here today. You clicked on this video, you know what it's about. This is Shadow and Bone. I'm going to be reacting to season two. I have not watched it. It is March 30th. It's been out for two weeks. I don't think I have seen any spoilers, but I have seen a few opinions. I tried really hard not to see any of them. I haven't talked to my friends about it. Um, and it seems like people are a little iffy about the plot. I know that this is the first season that we really break from Lee's plot. And gonna be real honest, I don't remember the plot of Shadow and Bone. Like, I remember the beginning and I remember the ending, but the middle bits, I'm a little lost. I'm not gonna be nitpicking like, oh, they changed this, oh, they changed that. I know that the crows are gonna be totally different because they were in the first one and that's fine. But yeah, I'm just gonna watch it and just, I don't have super high expectations. I don't have low expectations. I'm going in just to watch a show. I also think that just one issue I had, and it's not an issue, it's like a good problem to have um, with this series is that I love the cast so much that I'm almost more excited for like cast behind the scenes stuff and like all the interviews they do. I'm more excited for that than I am necessarily for them to play their characters. So I wasn't in a rush to go and watch this um like i thought i i would be but i was very much eating up like anything that was non-spoilery like all the silly ones like try not to laugh so yeah that's how i'm going into it i'm a very big fan of lee bardugo i enjoyed the first season i love the cast so much that's all okay so i'm gonna dive in i don't know how much i'm gonna need to cut for copyright purposes so if this is weird i apologize let us begin oh they just damn they just jumped right into it oh this is the recap this is the recap the recap's really good i gotta say here we go no shelter but me i just gotta say this now the women everyone everyone in this but the women in this show are the most beautiful women i've ever seen i just gotta say the set work on kayab the costumes oh Mal, check your info. Is he wearing a blue leather jacket? That's pretty, that's pretty wild. <laughs> Mal. Ooh, that's gorgeous. <laughs> Hot stones. <laughs> oh. What? <laughs> the fold, it moved overnight. You were right, girly. It is expanding. I did see someone, one critique I did see was just that the script wasn't that good. And I feel like I'm paying extra attention to it, which I normally wouldn't. Um, so, <gasps> get her damn. Oh, Jasper. The fuck? <gasps> How do you feel, boy? Oh my God, we're getting flashbacks. Baby Kaz. <laughs> I love her so much. I love you, nurse. Oh no, Kaz. He's touching people. Oh no. I was wondering. I knew they were gonna do the backstory, but I just wasn't sure how they were gonna show it. Criminals. Criminals. <laughs> I can't breathe. All my favorite people in the same room. I bet Inej is somewhere in that room, so. <laughs> oh, fuck. King Nikolai. Are we really having an only one bed trope in the first 15 minutes? Ah, oh, shoes on the bed. Oh! God, no. Really? Okay. Me back here at Ugh, why is this weird? Why is this weird? Okay, so far their their script has been cringe. We are not vultures. We are crows. Oh. <laughs> Freddy's face is so expressive without ever actually moving his face. Like I don't know how how to explain it. Kaz snitched. I don't know how I feel about that. 
Also, I love that script. That alphabet is so cool. Why does that look like a spaceship? You. <laughs> Why did she take such a big breath? <laughs> oh my god, like calls to like. That, line work on me anymore. that library is so nice. Librarians it's with magical nice. powers. Ooh. Don't steal. Okay. Oh. Ooh, I like that detail. Be gentle. That's she, that's like the oldest map. Oh, and you burned it. She was like, show me the oldest map you can find, and she's like, wow. <laughs> girl. Oh, she's quick! <gasps> Christ. <gasps> I know you. The Ravkin army. <laughs> they just got caught so fast. Not even a day. They got caught so fast. This is bizarre. Was she gonna open that lock with the sun? What? They're helping you go! The twins! <laughs> Okay, I actually love how they're being introduced. Yes! Go get my girl. It's not very good, is he? <laughs> Baby! Did he keep any of his money? Why? <gasps> They cast this show so well. I'm sorry, you do not catch an ash. <laughs> oh, who's making her entrance? Show yourself, my Irish queen. That was me. Hope you don't mind. <laughs> that was me. <laughs> you know what though? This it's incredible that this set it is really similar to how I imagine the prison. Like, I think that's a real testament to Lee's writing is that she wrote it in such a way that I could picture it so clearly and and clearly everyone kind of pictures it in a similar way because she wrote it so well. Ah! God, it just catches me off guard. <laughs> I do think though that yeah, Mal specifically, Mal's lines are all quite cringe. The map, um, the use of the map is quite cool. I'm not sure how much I like it, but it's interesting. My baby girl. Oh, that's right. I forget, is she like still on his side? I forget the dynamic. Is he gonna blow up? Wait. <laughs> what? I wasn't expecting you. Do you want? We've. I know that this, like, heist, Hellgate heist isn't happening. Nina. And Kaz is just like, mm. oh my god, they're all together. If Lee ever were to make a third Six of Crows, I want it to just be Inej and Nina on boat adventures. Oh shit, he did explode the crow club. Oh, Jasper. He means we need to leave right now. Also, like, who is who are they to, like, get on this ship and just be making demands? That, like, doesn't really make sense. Oh, shit. Okay, quick thoughts. Episode one, um, I do think that Mao specifically, and sort of Alina by default, um, the script, um, the dialogue is pretty cringe. I think that the crows are so good in comparison, so it just kind of makes them look bad, and I hate to be comparing, but but overall I'm excited. I very much am more excited for the crows than anything else. Okay, episode one, I'm gonna take take a break. I'm going to refill my water. Quick outfit change because I'm cold. So here we go. Episode two. I don't really need that opening sequence, but okay. Let us go. He never said that he was like keeping her. I don't <laughs> Privateer. Oh, he's excited. Go get it, Nikolai. Go get it. Oh. Ew, uh, Mal. Well, we do I just don't remember the books being like that. But then again, I remember nothing. So who am I? I will say the boat isn't how I pictured the boat, but that's okay. What the heck is that fruit bowl head in the back? 
Would the Darkling really have that? It's just so dramatic. I have to sneeze, but this is intense. But <coughs> Bless me. It's the same head thing. Did you see that? This dumb sculpture is in the background every time. Also, Daisy's crazy. If you watch some of the like behind the scenes things, she's so funny but she has no social media presence, so I feel like we never hear from her as much as the other cast. She is like insane in the best way. Where's David? Don't heal him. Screw that face up. Why do they always cough up blood? Why is everybody always coughing up blood? Poor Jenya. Stuck with this crazy man. Oh, baby cat. See, the writing in the crows section is like so different from the writing in the Alina section. <laughs> Inej! Nina! I love how it's always a heist. Somehow it's always a heist. Inej! That's my girl. Me too, Jesper. <laughs> I love them. Like, I just want the crows. I'm sorry, guys. I know we had to do Shadow and Bone first. Is that a lobster? What the hell is he eating? Oh, shit, it is a lobster. What happened to him? <gasps> oh, God is a woman. God is Nina Zenik. That's right, Matthias. <laughs> He's just such an asshole. Ew. He's gonna taxidermy and Nesh? Ew. Oh. Okay, no he's not. She's just a little annoying. Like, he's- she's so nice to the crew, but she's so mean to him. Oh, I love that! I know people were, like, upset about the Nikolai casting, but so far I think he's really good. Tracker friend. He still doesn't have a name. Probable. My little mad scientist. I'm just so bored of the Darkling. Who is she again? I don't even remember. Oh, shit. They're gonna find the Sea Whip in the island? I seem to remember it being like a battle out in the open sea. That's a scary noise. There it is. It's a lot smaller than I thought. Ew, it splat. I don't like it when things splatter on the camera, you know? Did you blind it? Or did you kill it? Oh shit. Alina! It's so small. That was like very anticlimactic. Oh, Nina. <laughs> Love that she can support Kazwecker Kazwecker's brain Kazbrecker's weight. Oh my god, with her bare hands and that rope. Eee. <laughs> Fine night. Oh fuck. Burning it up brought in a madman to capture your wraith. Oh no. You don't just name drop a Nej. If you weren't a dead man already. You threaten a Nej, my boy. The fuck? What the why is he dressed like that? What's going on? Did you get him? Did you get him? Joe. Ooh! Wait, wait, we have met before, haven't we? He brought him stroop waffles. I love stroop waffles. Bada bing, bada boom. Beat the newest member of my crew. <gasps> Nina! Oh, I'm stressed. Bite him! Go, Wylan. Wyland cares about his crew. He's one of them now. Will any of us be fine? Oh. I love Nikolai. I feel like summoning the sun on a wooden ship. <laughs> like, mm. what the? Jeez, Louise. On to chapter three. See, episode three. Episode three. <laughs> 
Okay, so I think this is going to be my last episode of the day just because I have other things to do. I feel like maybe I'm not remembering it correctly, but I thought that the whole sea whip thing took more time. Maybe it didn't, I don't know, but I was just like a little disappointed with the sea whip being like that tiny and like they found it and killed it. I don't know. Anyway, on to episode three, like calls to life. But I just gotta say, the set, the cinematography, real good. Come along. To oh my god, I can't wait to see how they do this. Oh my god. <laughs> Girly. That would freak me out though, that like you're, wow, they're really high, that like, you're depending on the one wind person. Next stop, destiny. Ooh, that's rough. Do your little thingy and like calm him the fuck down. What you did tonight made you a pro. Good job, Nina. Welcome. No, Jordy. Making sure you're comfortable. You left me locked up with that deranged time maker for weeks. I am rebuilding this country for the Grisha. We started this. The Grisha you treat like trash. They're just gonna fly into the fold. You can just feel that she's not ready. Like, this is not the time that the fold is gonna be destroyed. It just seems like we're wasting our time. I think, I feel like I just don't understand Alina as a character. Maybe that's the problem. Like she seems so overly confident for someone who was not just a few moments ago. As we knew. Oh, those Volker are ugly. Yeah, begin descent. You have a hole in your sail, bud. Oh. oh I this. Yeah, identify yourself, identify yourself Nikolai. Yourself. He's wearing that under his outfit? Jesus. <laughs> their uniforms are sick, though. I do like their uniforms. King of my heart. Of Ruler of the double eagle throne. <laughs> Woo! Like, her actions just don't make sense. Like, I just don't... Like, he just did everything that you asked him to. Ah, uh, I don't know. Woo! Yeah. Get the fuck out, David. Oh no, he's there. <laughs> Plagued by... Cough. I gotta say, guys, I am... Bored. All the shadow monsters in the room. The two of you just run off together. I love the costumes. Hey. I don't remember how she acted in the very last episodes towards Alina. <laughs> Poor Wyland. I love how his hair, he always looks like he's kind of been electrocuted. <laughs> Oh, wait, what? Wait, what? <laughs> it's baby Pekka. <laughs> oh my god. Easy way to anyone's heart. Yeah. Mm hmm. Uh, are we getting this scene? Are we getting this scene? Yes! See, she just needed to know it. Now she's on board. Add a girl. Oh my god. With his little shaky hand. You gotta make sure that's clean, bud. Don't just like tickle her with it. Oh, Nina! God, that's red. Oh my god, Kaz, don't do anything. I don't wanna pause it. What made you think you could kill Kaz Brecker? What are those guys doing just standing there? I just can't get over how much he looks like the Kaz in my mind. Incredible. I'm gonna skip this. I'm just kind of done with the fight scenes, to be honest. Ew, are you gonna- What the- <gasps> What the fuck? You- <laughs> I thought that was like the plan all along. I thought they wanted all three. Wait. <laughs> what kind of proposal? Now, fake dating trope. Why are we getting a uh, Alina Mal kiss scene in every episode? I don't remember the books 
having that. Just wanted to look at some ruins. Oh my god. Yeah, Wyland's a crow. <laughs> Kaz's hair kills me. Ooh, Kaz is smart. God, emo king. Oh, that's right, he has like wolf senses. Don't feed him with your hand. Don't feed him with your hand. Uh. We're taking the giant. Yeah, I'm skipping skipping fight scenes. I'm sorry, guys. <gasps> Time's dead still. <gasps> Pekka. Oh. Okay. I'm stopping for the day. I have watched three episodes. I am incredibly bored by the shadow and bone section. I just want the crows. Alina's just an annoying character. Like, I think they did a really good job of making Mal more likable than he was in the book because I didn't like or really remember him that much from the book. But Alina is like weirdly more annoying than I remember. Maybe it's just because my love of the crows like completely eclipses them, but Anyway, um, I'm going to end for the day and I will see you guys later. I need to film my monthly wrap up. So I will catch you guys then. Hi party people, we're back. Um, it is a new day. It's been a new day. It's been a couple of new days. It's been a while um, since I have checked in. Nothing to do with the show, simply to do with the fact that I have been out and about enjoying spring, but now it is really, really hot today. And so I'm staying inside with my Pokari sweat, not sponsored, but one day. Mark my words. Let's begin, shall we? I think we were on chapter, why can't I say episode? There we go. Episode four, I don't remember what was going on. Ooh, also my, um, I kind of broke my memory card, so if this messes up, how sad. Okay, here we go. They just kind of jumped right into this, didn't they? Uh-oh. It's... Oh, Her trying to smile. <laughs> Ooh, he can roll his R's. They just kind of like really jumped into this. Oh. Oh. They should have said you are my swamp. <laughs> Freddy is insane. Some comfort. <laughs> Nina and I will handle the Emerald Palace. Nina. Nina and I. No mourners. No <laughs> we like to keep our expectations low. I really like Inej. Like the way that they wrote her, they did a good job for her at least. <laughs> David. David. They're bigger than two men. His little shadow people. David is just kind of a, a rough character. Oh, he just speaks to the to the king like that, the prince like that. And Nikolai isn't offended because he's a big boy. Why is the door to the holding cell so flimsy? Oh my god. Oh. oh. He gets to tell stories. Good job, Mal. He clearly like went to the library. I had a boy. I agree, Mal. Oh my god. Uh, they're gonna send the crows to Shuhan. <gasps> Nina. Nina's smarter than this. I don't I don't believe this for a second. Poor Kaz, man. He's gone through it. What is this compound again? Oh, is there a baby on the ship? Inej. God, Inej is just the best. <gasps> Nina. Is it the plague? Oh my god. Oh, was she helping him not be in pain? Because that'd be nice. 
Okay, they went a little further. I didn't think he'd actually get kicked that much. He's so cute. I just can't get over. He looks, he's like so sharp. Where's Jesper? He's gonna, he's gonna move the bullet. It's gonna be great. Yep. God, Freddy's such a good actor. Why is he getting down so slowly? And get the fuck out of my city. <laughs> Why? Oh shit. Wouldn't Nikolai have like immediately pardoned him? You know? I just feel like they're rushing the shadow and bone so much that I mean to be fair, I didn't like the shadow and bone characters anyway, really, but it kind of feels like they're rushing the shadow and bone plot and giving the Six of Crows plot time to breathe. So it just the contrast between like the quality of the characters and stuff like that is apparent. And there's Albie, safe and sound, watching his dad get arrested. Ah! Da! The night that we first met. Yeah, tell us about that. I left because I assumed that's what you were going to do. Yeah, I get it. <laughs> They're just so good together, like as actors. Oh. Oh. <laughs> okay, that was like a not cringe kiss scene. I mean, it was cringe because I am cringe, but like, that was great. Oh, well, this is very different from the books. I'm mad that we're not gonna get a fake Wyland character, a Wyland lookalike, because that is a quite funny scene. She did her job, Kaz. Oh. Little worry wart. Is this gonna be like, oh, his face is really fucked up actually. Your plan fucking worked. Oh, because he's like, you're free. <sighs> Why isn't he a little bit happier? Why isn't there a little crow celebration going on? Magnificent. Oh, Nikolai. Like sunshine on the yeah. first Oh, Nikolai. Oh, oh shit. Not the ring, not the ring. There it is. God, that's gaudy. Yeah. Oh, Nikolai, he's a good guy. By the way, hey, where's Mal? What is that on the wall? It's like a manatee. Yeah, he would, girl. Yeah, he would. Friends hold hands. Friends hold hands, it's fine. Yeah, where is Mal? Ew. Get, he's so close to her. Nasty. Yep. See, that's not the size of two men, David. It is pretty cool looking though, I will say. The answer to the riddle is love. Oh shit, is he getting eaten? Eat him, eat him, eat him. <gasps> he just got ripped. <laughs> okay, Nikolai, like I feel like he could have run. Um, Leader of the second army, say something, Alina. Make a plan, make a plan. Kick down a door, y'all are Grisha. <laughs> what? I'm dead. Also, why does this palace look like a hospital? What is- why is her hair on fire? Why is her hair on fire? Oh, okay. Oh my god, no, don't- don't kill him. Okay, good. Stay alive. Yeah. Go away. Yucky. I thought they moved her. Holy shit, she broke her- She broke her hand so that she could get out of the thingy. Why hadn't she done that like a long time ago? Also, didn't Jenya get taken somewhere? Why is she back? Where was this energy four episodes ago? Yeah, yeah, I knew Audric was gonna die. Is his arm gone? It's literally a giant wasteland with monsters in it. You are like 500 years old, man. Oh, that's bad. Suddenly very not good CGI. Ah, <laughs> oh, give it a break. Okay, we are exactly halfway through. I'm just like not into the shadow and bone. I don't know how to explain it. Like it's, the Darkling is such a kind of stupid, villain like we just know he's not going to succeed we know that it's literally him against the entire world i don't know just kind of because of that everything feels a little bit cheesy i'm also feeling like i asked people not to give me their opinions but i definitely got people in my inbox being like i hated it and so now i feel like i'm being extra critical because 
I have heard that people didn't enjoy it as much. Keep that in mind that I'm, I've been a little bit spoiled by it, but, um, overall, like, the only, like, the good people have been, like, Jesper and Wylan, hit after hit after hit, excellent, great. Inej, very good. Kaz is just nuts. Like, I understand why he's the way that he is, um, and I think Freddy is an incredible actor. Nina, when she's allowed to shine, does shine, um, but kind of everyone else is just sort of given, I think, like, not a lot to work with. <laughs> um, the dialogue, the rushedness of the scenes, I don't know. So I will catch you guys in the second half. I can't believe we got a, we got a Wesper kiss. That's the bet, that's, okay. See you guys. <laughs> we rolling? Hi, right, we are back. Um, I'm going to be finishing the second season of Shadow and Bone Mm, maybe today. I have my tea ready to go. Everything is set up. I'm just going to dive in. Do I have any thoughts that I didn't share? Let's start with episode five. Despise your heart. <gasps> oh, the crows and then one of them was trapped. Oh. Yeah, your mom is super powerful. Of course she broke out. And you took her finger. <laughs> Serves you right. Oof. Oh, yikes. That was pretty gruesome. Oh, sh whoa. Okay. Yeah, they did amputate his arm. And Tamar just did it with an axe. What the fuck? What is the task? Oh, okay. Ravka. Oh. No. Don't stand now. <laughs> so, now that we all know that you two have history. But <laughs> the payment for this particular job. Name your price. I love Nina. The indestructible army of shadow monsters. I do not like the sound of that. Me neither, Jasper. You must be quite the slab of fur. He's not a slab of fur, Zoya. It's so are they gonna go to Shuhan? And your wraith? I'd rather push you away than admit he feels anything for you. Nina. See, okay, pause. Sorry, but like, the fact that these little details that like, make the characters so much more interesting, this isn't happening with Shadow and Bone. Like, very, very little. Basically just like, Tolia spouting his poetry, right? Um, but this little conversation that just is purely, like, sweet and funny, um, and is still pushing the plot forward and is important to the plot, but, like, there's just a difference, and I love it. I just love Nina. I just love Nina. Nina and Jesper and all of Wyland's facial expressions just, like, make this. Okay, starting. What the fuck is that? Oh, with his little, little gun. What are you gonna do? Oh, it's Bagra. It's fine. Oh, no. What are you doing? David, it's okay. It's not you. It's her. The puppy prince? The puppy prince? Kill him, Alina. Kill him. You can kill Nikolai now. Mm-mm. Nikolai, you are wrong. Mm-mm. Listen to all of these women. Wow, he knows quick. Come on, Nikolai. Boom! As future king of Ravki, you have my word. Now you tell us something we didn't know? Zoya, the sass at Kaz, I love. Ooh, I love tea shops. I'm not here for you. I'm here for Santalina. Said that, said that a little too strongly. What does it say? Why can't you read it? That's right. I completely forgot. Yeah. Not after what I heard. Your subjects were to be like your children. All of them. How did Nikolai come from this? Oh my god, we're going to Shu Han. <gasps> Ooh! And there's Shu script. Wow. There's a llama. What does that have to do with anything? Yeah, David. Your beauty is your armor. Oh. But what's inside you? 
and steel. Oh. It's brave and unbreakable, and it doesn't need fixing. Good job, David. <sighs> and wet. Not while I'm drinking tea, Kaz. Now all I'm gonna think of is warm and wet. She's so cool. God damn it, my husband. <laughs> Mina. I God uh, love her. <gasps> Put your gloves back on, babe. No, 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 no. Don't touch him. Put his gloves on. Oh. Oh, she got his gloves. Good girl. Are we practicing mental shields? Okay, that's the opposite of blocking him. That's talking directly to him. Please don't burn down your only safe place. Ooh, yep, yep, there we go. Yeah, give them some time alone. <laughs> also, hey, Mal's been missing for a few days. Welcome back, babe. Oh, they having their first fight? I feel like this episode they're doing a lot better. <clears throat> Her head is bleeding? Oh, because she fell on the ground. Tolia's like eating all of the food he can get here while he can. Heist, 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 heist. I'll go with Nina. I install you don't hate me. You've abandoned your country when it needs you most. She is literally working for Ravka right now, Zoya. Calm down. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Wait, they all look the same and it's really dark. Is that Pekka killing his roommate? <gasps> Oh my god, what the fuck? Wait, I'm so confused. Oh, okay, they look the same. Feel your belly. Feel your belly. This is weird. Oh, he sniffles softly, says the subtitle. Oh, it's his lucky coming feathers. Love you, Nikolai. I'll miss you. He didn't correct her because it is impossible damn my laptop is full brightness i cannot see anything this whole episode has been so dark i feel like tolia should go first if he knows this stuff oh now they're both mad good lord come on zoya you lost her what's wrong with her who the What the fuck? Oh, buddy, 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 buddy. Wyland, don't set up those firecrackers. Yeah, Nina's not gonna break. Oh, God. No, no, no. What the? What? All right. Hold on, hold on, before we go into that next episode. I do think that that so far has been the best episode. And also, like, just once again, Six of Crows is so much faster paced, right? They've done so many things already. But yeah, so far I think that episode five has been the best one yet. On to episode six. Why does he look like a soldier from the 1940s popping out of World War II? What the? Ew, Jordy. What is this gas? Are we getting Inej flashbacks? What is this, girl? <laughs> Why is Kaz getting, like, trauma? Oh my god, is he telecommunicating? Is Tolia the butterfly? God, you nerd. Focus. Is Tolia doing, like, this poetic metaphor trying to speak to Wylan? What are you dreaming about, babe? What was that, mama? Just... Yeah, it is. He's a little rabbit. <laughs> Wait, so they've got like happy memories. Poor Kaz, man. I remember like one of the twists, but like I forget this part for, of the book. The, uh, this timeline doesn't make sense then. Right? Holy shit, Bagra. 
I don't remember. This Was this changed? I just don't understand what he's doing. He's just like waiting for people to find Alina, but like walking around cutting down shit. Ugh, there you go. Oh, I, meanwhile, I'm thinking like Tolia's communicating with the butterflies. He's just yelling. <laughs> make, make the hole bigger, babe. What's going on? You're letting him take your knives? What's happening? They're so weird. I love them together, but they're so weird. What? I'm not getting my hopes up. Nina's gonna cough or something. Oh my god. She's like, no way, Kaz. Oh my god, what? <laughs> so Kaz is like keeping her at like five arms lengths is what saves her life, I guess. So open, make a bigger hole. Like, I just don't understand why Wylan has been just like... She doesn't even ask, it's already in her mouth. Knock has first. Anesh. He doesn't want to wake up, maybe. Wylan did? did? Thanks, bud. Are we gonna kidnap another kid? Watch it be Albie. <laughs> oh, that- okay, okay. Bagra's just like everyone's mom. <laughs> Yep. She's like your great, 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 great aunt. Oh, so he's got a die, die. That's right. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah. Ooh. Oh, God. She is a vicious, vicious lady. Kaz is just gonna walk over and bop her in the head with the cane. Why is everyone choking in this episode? Oh, shit. Wyland once again. What are you gonna do? My my time here is done. Once I've killed my son. God, Bagra, you are dark. You took her finger bone. Oh, she's gonna do the cut? Holy shit. Or she's gonna try. Oh no, the shadow. They're gonna kill her before she could do anything. Did she just cut off his hand? Kaz, really? Like, if you've got some plan... Now's the time. Oh, bullshit. Hmm. Truly. Kaz's future. <laughs> He's gonna be like the wise old grandfather thief. He's like, the, the story, it's real. It was an honor that she almost killed me. Inej is like fangirling, come on. I love that she covers his ears. Is that a coffin? My first husband. What the fuck? Terrible marriage. <laughs> oh, I like her now that she's not trying to kill everybody. Oh, they're the best part of this. Far away. Off the map. Deep in love. Deep in love. Oh, I wish. <laughs> Sorry, that was loud. God, they just communicate so weirdly. Hope is dangerous. Oh, that's not what you were supposed to get out of that, Anish. Literally, all they do is hug. <laughs> About that. I'm the firebird. You are the one who's like, we don't need to kill the amplifiers. You know there's another way, girl. Oh, I am skipping this. Holy shit. I don't think that was in the book. <laughs> oh no. So he knows. Fuck. I go. Okay, test, test. Hello there. It's a new day. It is so blustery, rainy, gorgeous outside. I just went and donated blood. So if you see me snacking on crackers, I'll try to keep the crunching to a minimum, but on we go to episode seven and eight. And I'm so 
so interested in how they're going to finish this especially shadow and bone like they've set up six of crows so well to just like continue through whatever happens in the rest of the world the crows will always have something to do shadow and bone i don't know how far they're gonna take it in the story are they gonna start bleeding into king of scars are we gonna bleed into the ice court heist are we even ever going to get an ice ice court heist i don't want to spoil anything if you haven't read the books but like what are they up to in that writing room i wonder um so anyway here we go where am i meet you in the meadow who is this tide maker is she in the books i don't remember is she gonna drown a village because that's not cute your orders your orders jesus oh I forgot. That's also how <laughs> episode six ended. Oh shit. He's so tiny compared to Mal. Holy shit. Did you see that? <laughs> oh, that's right. They're cousins. Ah. I love it when Ben Barnes' ears move. That's like a trait of his. Eh? Alina, your king is speaking. He's a great guy, guys. I gotta say. I'm not biased. Thank you. Trust Nikolai with this knowledge. Oh, he's the firebird. He's the firebird. Look at him calculating. God, I love him. He's gonna figure it out. Don't worry. So I still don't quite know what the plan is. <laughs> he's like, please, I don't want to know. Oh. Oh, Nikolai. Oh, you're so lucky, Mal. Oh, this is like the most romantic scene that's happened in this series. Oh. Yeah, why? Oh, okay, David. Try harder. Gemstone fact. Gemstone fact. <laughs> okay, Alina, don't do anything. I'm gonna go get water. Stop it, Mal. Stop it, Mal. Mal. <laughs> Wouldn't that cause, like, brain damage? I love it. What has Alina actually done? Thank you. What did they amputate? I don't remember the books. You didn't test it out? Yeah, you're about to board an airplane that only you can lift up and you haven't tested your powers yet, my boy. Oh, of course, it's a Nikolai's ship. Damn. Time for the chop. What's what? What the fuck? No, no, no. There it is. Babes, babes, babes. Who is this chick? <laughs> That's enough. <laughs> That's enough, Pekka. Oh, who would? Who would? <laughs> Matthias is just like, the fuck? Probably didn't understand a word he said. You got this, David. Don't. Don't show Mal. I hate how nervous he looks. He. God. This is like more fingers cut off. What the fuck? Oh shit. Where did they go? Go on, Nikolai, go on. Oh good. God, he's been through it for a side character, man. Not Nikolai, what's his name? Him. <laughs> they like do not care about camouflage whatsoever. <laughs> Why is it suddenly like black and white? What's wrong with him? Oh, is he going into the fold? I see. Okay. <laughs> I was like, mm, something wrong with my screen. Whoa. Do something, David. Number one priority, Nikolai, always. Yeah, I just feel like you should never walk towards the fold. Like, I just think that that's... Yeah. Do it now. Eat his finger. Oh, God. Oh, no. I can't see a damn thing. It is so dark. Fuck. Yep. Did it rip off his little finger? Because that's what we gotta do. Did the Darkling cut his own- Saint Inej! Oh my god, she's such a badass. Like, why do I want to cry? <laughs> oh, hello. <gasps> Nikolai. Nice! 
Oh, he's gonna die. Please don't. Please don't die. No, he's gonna die. Your friend is gonna die. Oh, it's water. That's right. I keep forgetting, like, what the fuck she is. No, your little friend, your little friend, your little friend. Oh! Talia's back. Yep, he's gonna get one right in the back. Yep. Don't put him on his back. Ah. Oh, they went all the way through. Nikolai has all the romantic bromance scenes and I love it. Everyone loves Nikolai. <laughs> what are you doing? What did she get in? Why couldn't they both fit and he could have done it from the inside? I just don't. Bye. Fucking love the crows. I would not feel safe if those three boys showed up to be like, I'm saving the day. I would just be like, dead man walking. <laughs> Poor Tamar, she's like, the fuck? Surrounded by idiot men, always. What are his pants? Oh, he's in like a kilt. Dig it. Get it, Jasper. Air support. My babe. Girl, why is she, why are you? Jesper. Holy. Oh, Nikolai, women's rights. Feminism is equality. You can shoot girls, I guess. Jesper, that was sick. Is that a, why did he? It's so dark, I thought that was a donkey. I was like, why is there a mule in the fold? They need to brighten this up, Alina. Oh. Inej is having her moment. What happens if you're in the fold when you destroy it though? Like, are Zoya, Nina, and Inej not concerned? Why do you give him time to speak? Just zap him. Oh, it's the bad CGI again. Ooh, nice shot, girlfriend. Yeah, I feel like half a cut is probably worse than the actual cut. Oh shit, with what? Oh no. <laughs> You're just like, I'm hit. <laughs> Wait, where, the, where did Nina go? Nina, no, 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 no. Wow, they're gonna end the episode like right here. Yeah, they are. All right, I took a break to have lunch. I was thinking, how are they, excuse me, how are they going to end this for Shadow and Bone? And I think my idea is they are going to have Mal become Sturmhund or however you pronounce Nikolai's alter ego. I don't think we're gonna go the route in which the books ended because if this continues for multiple series or multiple seasons, I think they're gonna wanna be have a way to call back Alina and Mal in a way that's more interesting than how they end up in the book. So I think we might see Mal become a pirate. Here we go. <gasps> Oh, because Nikolai's like me. God, he is so emo. Oh my God, he's using the crow cane. It's so dark. I can't see anything on this screen. Where's David? Wyland. God, they're a good team. Where is Nina? Girly. Not me forgetting how the book ends. Holy shit. What? Wait. Oh shit. The Darkling, just go the fuck away. Uh, oh, I forgot. Fuck. Yeah. Get Nina. Go chop off the Darkling's head. Nina, do the job. Oh, I love her freckles. Oh, no. You stabbed him like in the heart. The knife is still in there, Alina. Didn't Nina get like sucked up by the Volcra? Like, doesn't she need to be healed? Why is no one killing the darkling <laughs> sorry there he goes inej your cue oh shit babe oh. Ooh. Uh... Come on, you <laughs> nina ew do you see her hand Ooh. Oh, Nina, she's like, girl, I know what you did. Okay. Is anyone gonna ask if Nina's okay? Ravenoff. Canto 17. <laughs> Kaz is like, mm, don't tell anybody. <gasps> and now she's back. Okay, now talk to Kaz. Tell Nikolai about Zoya and Ash. Hug it out. Hug it out. 
Hug it out. Mm, not you, Jester. Not you. Oh my god, he wants to go off and be a privateer. Is he just like meditating on that sand tree? What are you doing? I want you to put me into the fights. Why? Where's David? Yeah. Hurry. Look around. He probably pulled some weird, like he melded himself into a wall. He's fine. <gasps> Was he drawing her a ring? Fucker. Where is he? Jenya literally like just gets fucked over in this series. I feel like that's gonna take a while. Firebird rises from the ashes, it is not the same. <laughs> He's just, Nikolai is just talking to Mal, that's just so funny. Do the crows just leave? Bye. What was that? Was that some kind of symbolism that I missed? Nope. I could see myself as. Here it comes. Morza. Boom, baby. He's trying not to look too excited. He's already like in. There's still 30 minutes left. He's so excited. He's like, oh fuck yeah, I get to be a pirate. To say Two, is Inej gonna be head of Alina's guard? Because damn, that'd be sick. Oh, <laughs> Kaz is so scared of Inej. Stay. Stay with me. I want you. Why is this the most intense scene? And we've had like so many deaths. Oh, I forgot this. Fuck. Mm, he's trying. That was a baby step, Kaz. Oh my god, here he comes! These two. Oh. <gasps> oh my god. Inej? What? Wait, but what about the crows? I don't know how I feel about this. Oh no, wait, 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 wait. Wait a damn minute. That's a weird group. What is happening? He looks like a little kid in that coat. I'm sorry. It's way too big. Fuck, I love her. I wish Nina came with her. Isn't Matthias free now? What is going on? Oh my god, is he gonna fight Nina? He's gonna pull her into the ring? What the fuck? What is going on? Oh, he has to fight a wolf? No, he can't fight the wolves. <gasps> Oops. What? Why is this at the end of the season? Oh, oh the crow club's back. Did he get a haircut? He's looking a little... Mm sharper what a weird way to end the season there's just so much oh is this the fucking weird ass priest oh blah 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 can't you like fire his ass he looks like he's wearing a hockey uniform that's what i thought he was wearing the priest guy oh, oh shit he broke the chair oh Ooh. Him. We know. Where's David? Ew, what an ugly crown. What the fuck? Why is my crown so ugly? I'm only okay with this because he's Irish. Who the fuck? Security? Is no one noticing this girl? Ew! What the fuck? Okay, quickly my thoughts. Mm, I thought that the second half was more interesting just because like it obviously the pace kind of picked up. I firmly stand by the fact that the crows were much better written until the end where we were forced to separate them in order to help further stories. I love I love it for her. I love it for her that Inej is going after the slavers, but I don't love it for us. Like I really love all of the crows together. So that's something I didn't like the kind of super cut of how we're going to continue to the next season. That just felt choppy and I don't know. I just, I didn't really like it. I get why they had to do it, but I felt like it could have been done a little less 
rushed maybe I don't know or we just didn't have to split them up into that many things like we used to have just kind of like two factions but now we have like four or five going in four or five different directions I don't know um so overall this one was just a little bit messy because of how much they were trying to achieve with it i do think like the shu han portion i really liked and how they were able to work together with that like i i liked how they tied it in but um let me know your thoughts down below i thought that the crows i mean every scene that nina was in i adored it i think that zoya is showing hints that her character is going to be a lot better which i mean she has to i love Wyland and Jesper so much. I hope we get a body double. I really hope we get a Wyland lookalike. That would still make me really happy. I appreciated that Nikolai had a bromance with every bro. Um, yeah, I just kind of don't quite know what I feel, but I just feel kind of meh. There were bits that I really liked and bits that I was so bored by. But anyway, I will catch you guys next time I'm going to edit this up. Please, please, please let me know your thoughts down below. Um, I'm also just, I said this for the first season, I'm not really a TV person. So watching eight episodes of something um, usually isn't super my style. So as if you are a TV watcher, let me know your thoughts and see you later, okay? Thank you for spending all of this time with me. This was fun to at least share it with someone. And okay, bye, bye.